Hey folks, uh, this is Bert. Today I'm going to talk about the Ecotech Radeon, um, Radeon Mounting System, or RMS, for the Ecotech XR15 Pro uh, Lite. This RMS system is uh, a mount that you could put on your tank and allows you to put your XR15 Lite on it. It's pretty well made. Uh, it's made of metal. This stand here is made of metal. Um, they come in two sizes, one for the XR15 and one for the XR30. You could also get uh, attachments to it so that you can have multi lights uh, put on it as well. Um, I, I there's some things I like about it and some things that I don't. Now, don't mind the fact that I only have one XR15 on there and it's on the left hand side of the tank. That's because the tank itself has this thing in the middle here and it kind of holds the whole tank together. It's not a rimless tank. I got this light and fixed uh, the light and the rail because um, eventually I'm going to upgrade from my 36 gallon bow front to um, I think it's a 45 or 60 gallon tank which is square two feet by two feet by two feet a cube. So the one light is going to be good enough for that. But until then, I just have it there mounted on the left hand side of the tank. Uh, the light itself, I'm not here to review the light. That's for another video and I'm sure that there are plenty of videos on YouTube to uh, address the review of the light itself. But I'm here to talk about the mounting system. Uh, I got this from Marine Depot. It was about 90 bucks. They shipped it out pretty quickly. And the things that I like about it is that it, it gives a sleek look to the tank. Now just imagine this was, well, actually, I can't do that, can I? Um, imagine if this was a cube tank. It, it just looks good. But the problems that I have with it is that the way that it mounts, this, this light here physically attaches to this bracket here by these screws. One here, one here, one in the back. It's like an, it's an X pattern. So this is part of this X pattern. And that's how you attach the light to this with these four screws. Once you attach the light to this bracket here, you then slide this bracket onto the mount here and you tighten it. But the way that you tighten it is via a screw that's underneath here. And you can't screw it on if the light is on the X. So I had to take the light itself, the fixture, off of this X brace let me show from the top see this x brace i had to take the light off of the x brace so to be able to reach the screw that's under here to tighten this bracket onto the rail that's not convenient at all um if i want to loosen it now to slide because this is adjustable you could slide this in and out um, depending on the size tank you have, if you had a, a lot wider tank, you would be able to move this out a little bit more by loosening that screw that's under here and then sliding this out. But because of the fact that that screw was under there, I can't reach it. So that's really not a convenient piece. Um, another problem that I have with this light is that if you look at it from here like this, see I'm a pain in the butt perfectionist that light is not perpendicular to the surface of the water it's tilting down a little bit the front of the the front of that light is a little bit more down than the back of the light so as you can see it's it's kind of like a tilting it's like an angle um I don't know if that's on purpose or is it because of the design of the of the mounting bracket I, I don't know Anyway, every time I come down the stairs, I, I see that and that kind of annoys me. Um, other than that, I think it's a pretty solid bracket. I mean, the way that it comes, the, uh, the way that it attaches to your fish tank, there's this here. You put it over, now you could have either a rimmed tank or a rimless tank. This uh, bracket will fit both uh, types of tanks. And there's a knob in the back to tighten or loosen. Um, what else do I say about this? this? Oh, another, another thing that I find it very inconvenient is that the, the Ecotech Radions, you can plug them into a computer 
to program them. It has a little uh, mini USB or micro USB port here and you plug it in here and then you plug the other end to your computer via USB. Um, my computer is way over there and the cord does not reach. So what do I have to do? I need to take the light off of the fixture in order to move them closer to the computer or to bring a laptop that I have down to the to the basement here. Um, if I do need to take, if I do decide to take the light off of the fixture to bring it closer to the computer to program it because I don't have a reef link, it's a pain in the butt because I have to, I can't just un uh, loosen it and take it out and bring it to the computer. I have to uh, remove the fixture from this X bracket via these four screws and then be able to bring it next to the computer. I find that very, very uh, cumbersome. Um, and that is my review of the Ecotech RMS system for the XR15. Thank you very much. Bye.